You can taste the freeze dry. Mm -mm. mm -mm. I love that. What are you doing? <laughs> Ew, that is so disgusting. What's, What's up, up guys? guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. I'm Chris. And I'm Lex. And if you're new here, please make sure you go and subscribe down below as well as click that bell icon so you are notified every single time we post a brand new video. So before we get started with today's video, just want to give a big shout out to Gotham Central for providing us with an awesome product to review. Stay tuned till the end to find out what it is. Now, as most of you guys know, it is already past September 1st, and for all of you fall lovers like me, you know what that means, and that means that Halloween is coming! Which is your favorite holiday. It is my favorite holiday for everybody that knows me, and I am like obsessed with Halloween, so this is like a super exciting time for me. That is why I kind of look very festive today. I'm wearing my, my new orange shirt, and Alex is wearing his black, so we can match. It looks a little, little pumpkin-y. Halloween. <laughs> Halloweeny. And it also ties into our video today, which is... Today we're going to be trying a whole bunch of different sweet treats that came across the border from the UK and from the States. And we're super excited because you know how much candy means to all of us. That is literally the main point of Halloween is to go trick-or-treating and get this candy. Halloween isn't for the next little while, but we're so excited that we just had to grab all of these snacks now. Let's get right into the review. First, we're gonna start with the wrap snacks. Now, our friends at Gotham Central really spoke highly about these chips, especially the sour cream with a dab of ranch flavor. So we're gonna try these ones. We got Migos on them. <laughs> you guys see that this time? <laughs> it's like they're here. It's like the Migos are eating with them. I think that's so funny though, wrap snacks. Well, when they're wrapping, they gotta be snacking. Yo. Do they smell good? It smells like ranch. Okay. They just smell like potato chips. What do you mean? I like them. But those taste weird, do you yeah, like? That's good. Hmm. I think you, they're pretty okay. What do you rate it? I'm putting the Migos at a seven. I was gonna say eight. Oh, really? Yeah. That's the, pretty high. The ranch gives it a good kick at the end. So what, we're gonna roughly put that at a 7.5 out of 10? Yeah. Dually? Yeah. Next, we're gonna try the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup Cakes. But they look like donuts. It says chocolate cupcakes with peanut butter flavored icing and filling made with Reese's Peanut Butter. I don't know, the fact that they made anything Reese into a cupcake. If like, it's not from Canada, it has to be. Batty. Batty. Look, it's so cute and it's matching our, our Halloween theme that we have going on. I mean, sprinkles. Bite it together. Ready? Uh -huh. It's like a fluffy Reese peanut butter cup. Mmm. The filling inside is good. It's like they stole the recipe from Hostess and they just filled it up with melted Reese peanut butter. That looks pretty good, but the chocolate is overpowering the peanut butter. I'd say it's six. Yeah, I mean, it's it's nicely edible. I mean, I wouldn't mind eating one. I don't think I'd be able to eat the two Ooh, in a pack. We no. could definitely share it with somebody. So yeah, I guess we could go with six. Yeah. Solid six. I don't have much else to say about it. So I was super excited when I found this. It's called the Mega Load. And what it is, is it's essentially three peanut butter cups and each cup comes with something different on it. So one we're getting with like a chocolate chip cookie. The other we're getting with like Smarties or- M&M's I guess what would be an M&M. The Oreo one looks weird. Yeah, and then there's an Oreo one. So we open these up and see what they taste like. So this is what it looks like inside. It looks cute still though. You know those <laughs> those like school chips away pouches that you can like, bring with you? Yeah. Looks like that. There's peanut butter, but there's no peanut butter in it. It just tastes like a peanut butter cup. Yeah. Yeah. I'm mm. gonna say like a six because I do like peanut butter cups. Man, I was excited about that one. I was too. It looked exciting. I thought it was gonna be like extra good and extra tasty, so. So five and a half. Five and a half. Collectively. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Moving on. <laughs> Apparently these are new. 
chocolatey payday? Brand new. Brand new. Brand new. Very Nobody else has them apparently. So well, I believe it for Canada because we yeah. don't have a lot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I guess I'll take a first bite. And it's gonna be tasty to me because I love nuts. Oh wow. It looks like an old Henry. There's a little saltiness at the beginning. I like it. I think it's pretty That's good. That's literally an O'Henry. Okay, yeah, see, this makes sense. It's peanut and caramel bar. Dude, this entire video Covered is, with chocolate. It's peanut chocolate. <laughs> it's a, an American O'Henry bar. That's all it is. No, it's just a peanut bar. Yeah, but like, that has to be the caramel yeah. inside in the middle, just yeah. like an O'Henry. Yeah. Except O'Henry, I think, uses nougat or something, doesn't it? I don't know. Personally, I've never eaten an O. Henry. It literally just tastes drink. just like an O. Henry. So nine. I'm gonna say that's a nine. Yeah, I'm gonna give the nine because it doesn't actually say O. Henry on it. Thanks for making it exciting, though. Yeah, it tastes really good, though. I can eat more of this later. Okay, you keep that one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Payday. Now this one I was super excited about too. It's a snowball. I've seen these and. I've always wanted to try one, and I've never tried one in my life. I just like the color. I know, it's so vibrant, right? Can I just like, can I see this? Isn't it cute? Oh, it's coconut. <laughs> it's like a chocolate marshmallow, okay. Oh, it looks like Hopia. What? <laughs> Sorry, guys, I hate coconut so much. Hang on. I'm not gonna lie, I thought this was gonna taste better. I'm gonna give it a four. I'm gonna give it a zero because I'm biased. I don't like coconut. See, I like the marshmallow taste, but the thing that made it not so good to me was the cake inside. It's not as like moist. Is that the word I'm looking for? Probably. Mm -mm. Kind of weird. Not a big, not a big fan. Zero for me. Zero? Yeah, sorry. I'm bi like I said, I'm biased. And so like the two, two <laughs> freeze dried ice cream sandwiches. Never heard of them in my life, but the people at the comic book shop were like freaking out. Like, oh my god, they're here! And we got two flavors: Neapolitan and just regular vanilla. I assume you'd want Neapolitan because you don't like vanilla. Yeah, I hate vanilla. For all of you who know, mm -mm, I am not a vanilla person at all. Oh wait, show them the packaging. Here, one more time for you guys. Is this so I don't get it. Do they just like freeze dry it? Is that what? Oh, it comes in a little wrapper. That's so weird. Freeze oh, dry? God. It's, it's like gonna go dust. everywhere. It's meant for the moon. It's a dusty ice cream sandwich. I, I can't think even you, you break it. it. You gotta bite it. Yo, but it's broken. They're hard, but like, check it out. Okay, mine's breaking. It, it feels like a dried marshmallow. <laughs> okay, so this is the inside <laughs> because mine broke. So I'm just gonna eat this part, so. Ow. Oh. It tastes stale. <laughs> is that what this is supposed to taste? <laughs> you can taste the freeze dryness. Mm -mm. mm -mm. I love that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ew, that is so disgusting. It's a zero out of ten for me. I'm still gonna put it at a six. Like it's good. How the heck is that a six? Okay. That's disgusting. It's pretty good. Like it just tastes like a malt cookie. Fudge brownie M Ms. I feel like so. they're just gonna taste like regular M Ms. I'm super excited for this because all of you guys who are longtime subscribers know how we feel about M&Ms from our 20 minute adventure video to the US. The hazelnut ones were the best. They were so good. So I have very high expectations for m and and I'm really hoping that they like do justice with these because I also love chocolate fudge. But like, I feel like you have to have that like like a little ball of fudge inside of the M&M. You um, know what I mean? We'll have to wait and see in the package. I know. All right. All right. Oh no. Oh, it tastes like fudge. It was like right at the end though. It's like right in the middle of it. Mm. That is such a tiny piece of fudge. It's literally a thicker M&M. Yeah, it's pretty much a thicker m m But I mean, it tastes really good, so. I'll put it at an eight. I'll put these at an eight out of 10. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm down with that. Eight out of 10 for the fudge brownie m ms oh, She also grabbed these ones. <laughs> <laughs> Let's 
Like at this point, we might as well be sponsored by Reese. <laughs> Look I'm at this. sorry. Look I'm at this. sorry. The orange just caught my the eye. The whole video. What did I tell you guys? It's, it's September. It's Halloween placement. time. It's product placement. <laughs> but it's pretty much the chocolate Hashtag chips. Hashtag not sponsored. Yes. <laughs> Wait, oh yeah, we have to say that. <laughs> so pretty much the chocolate chips are replaced with the peanut butter cups. So. I think so. No, there's chocolate chips in there. There's just big pieces of Reese. It, it's a reverse mega load. Yeah, kind so. of. Let me see what that's like. Oh my god. This is good. You need a bottle. I gotta pick the snacks next time, man. <laughs> Everything with peanut butter so far in this video. <laughs> well, I chose most of them. You were too busy looking at all the collectibles, sir. Three? Four? I personally like chips of eye cookies, especially the harder ones instead of the soft chewy ones. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna go with maybe a six on these. I'm gonna go four. four. Five. Five collectively. Five. Okay. All right. Fair enough. We gotta meet in the middle, so. Yeah. Okay. Let's get to the next one. So she picked these up. It's the Honey Clover Lucky Charms. And it sounds really promising. We both like Lucky Charms. And I so. like honey. <laughs> so, <laughs> so. Same. Hopefully, it's as good as it looks. I'm hoping that it's as good as it looks because I think only like two things on this table have gotten higher than a six. Ooh, smells good. But maybe it just car. Maybe it just smells cardboard. All I smell is cardboard. <laughs> so I think he just likes the smell of the cardboard. I guess I'll just eat cardboard. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. That's all marshmallow. It's already a 10. <laughs> oh, you've got all the unicorns. Here, I'll trade you. <laughs> it's like Captain Crunch. It's very lightly honeyed. I wouldn't say it's like hardcore honey. Mm -mm. I thought it was gonna be hardcore. Maybe you gotta put it in milk. Mm -hmm. Yeah, probably. Mm. Of course, because of Lucky Charms. I'm gonna get that, I would say an eight. An eight? Yeah, I'd probably say an eight's a good way to go. I'm actually gonna like go equal with you on that. Cause I mean, I it like could do better, better yeah. probably, but I think that they could have done better we with the honey. We need some milk. <laughs> <laughs> so if you don't already follow us on our social media platforms, here they are below for you. Make sure you go follow us. And also don't forget to comment down below if there are any other snacks that maybe we haven't tried yet that you think we should try out let us know down below also make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you loved any of the snacks that you saw and want to learn more about some of them okay so we are super close to the end but i also had to grab these because they totally fit the theme of my fall septemberness right now <laughs> and it's also a kit kat which is also one of my favorite chocolate bars but it's pumpkin pie flavored and I am super excited to try it. And Which I was so really excited new. when I saw them. Yeah, it's also really new. They're already out in the States right now, but again, because they're not in Canada, we don't get them. So nobody here has them unless it's from a specialty store. Premium price Kit Kat. <laughs> yeah, and I know Alex isn't the biggest fan of pumpkin pie, but I, I love it. And he's You can just try. see me staring at it. <laughs> I, I tried the coconut thing already, so I might as well just go with these ones. You, you can always only try everything once. You can always run to the garbage. You are yeah, right. you can always <laughs> run to the garbage. So here, I'll give you that one. Oh, oh it smells spicy. Oh, like a candy. <laughs> Okay, it really smelled like a can. How rude. <laughs> I'm gonna do a five. I'm gonna yeah. do a five. Yeah, what about you? One. One. Okay, so three. I mean, it's still cute though, and the packaging I love, is great. I love the packaging. This is coming from a graphic designer. Kit Kat, But you I guys, don't like pumpkin. You guys have some awesome packaging. Hire me. I yeah. will do this for you. <laughs> Honestly, if you guys need a new graphic designer, like... Kit Kat, hire me. <laughs> Freelance. Now for our final snack, we were actually asked to do a review of a specialty snack, 
which mm -hmm. is super exciting and it is actually branded for this year's Halloween season mm -hmm. and we are super lucky and thankful to have been given this to do a review on our channel for so thank you to all of our friends at Gotham Central for helping us get this review for today once again <laughs> and we will put all of their information down below you should definitely go either check out their store in person if you live in Mississauga Toronto GTA in Canada or you can even order stuff from their store, I believe. So go check them out. Their link will be down below. Now on to the review. So the snack that we are reviewing is for Kit Kat. Kit Kat, like, we love you. <laughs> it's like sponsored by Kit Kat and Reese. <laughs> but not. <laughs> so maybe for our next video, you guys should like, you know, sponsor, sponsor. the video. <laughs> but anyway, we're gonna cut to the b-roll so you guys can see the brand new snack that's going to be available for i believe the for u.s halloween season. for halloween season so this new kit kat is called the witch's brew flavor and as you've seen in the b-roll it is actually crisp wafers and marshmallow so it should be really good the packaging looks amazing totally dead set on halloween I love the witch. I think it's adorable. And I like the fact that they did like the old school purple and green rather than just like the basic orange and black that everybody's used to seeing. Yeah. It gives it kind of like a, a fun vibe too. Honestly, whoa. Is it green? I can't, no, it's like a. No, it's like mint green. It's like mint. Ooh, it smells like really smell. good. I'm gonna take a peek. So this is what it looks like on the outside. Oh, I broke it. Okay, are you ready to try it? Wow, those are very sweet. Mm-hmm. Yo, you kids? The kids are gonna love this. Oh my god. Americans are gonna love this. What does this taste like to me? Marshmallow and crisp wafer. <laughs> it tastes like a rice crispy. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a rice crispy, but in a Kit Kat. No, it really tastes like a rice crispy. It's pretty mm -hmm. good though. Wow, that is really good. All in all, between like this brand new Kit Kat versus the pumpkin pie one, this is definitely the winner. This forget tastes, pumpkin pie, dude. Forget pumpkin pie. This tastes amazing. Kit Kat, like you, mm. that's good. Oh my god, you guys are one competitor to beat on the Halloween market this year. Kids are very gonna. Sweet. Mm, it's, it's very like sweet. It's very sweet, but kids are gonna with, love it. Yeah, it's like overloaded with marshmallow, but it's still really good though. I mean, kids are all about the sugar anyway, right? So this as soon as true. they taste it, it's gonna be like, oh my god, this is amazing. Gotham Central is that store to go to for all of those special snack treats. Mm -hmm. Like they are the ones to go to if you guys want to be adventurous and try anything new from across borders that you've never seen or tried before. Yeah. And again, thank you so much to Gotham Central and everybody that works there that helped us get all of these snacks when we were there the other day because they really took the time out of their day to Show help us. us. Every and snack. Yeah, even the ones that were in the boxes, they opened the boxes for us and we could not have been more grateful and we cannot wait to go back and get more snacks because they said mm -hmm. that there's more coming. So. They said this week. Yeah, they said this week. So maybe we're gonna end up doing another snack video. We don't Who knows? Know. I mean, we have quite a few snack videos if you haven't checked those out already. Yeah, I mean, we have the whole Filipino food video. So, I mean, if you guys haven't checked that out, just go and put the link up above and it should be there for you guys to go see too. Mm -hmm. That's it for this video, you guys. Thanks again for tuning in. If you're not already, don't forget to subscribe down below as well as hit the bell icon. That way you know every single time that we post a brand new video. Also, don't forget to like this video as well as to leave a comment down below and let us know what your favorite snack of the day was. That's it for this one, guys. And we'll see you in the next one.